Good morning. Today we're going to do something completely different. First of all, we need to catch a bus and then a train. There's the bus. I'm going with this lot today, Gloria and Fabrizio. I did a couple of hikes with last winter and Gloria's sister and her boyfriend. And here's the bus. Just got a bus to Piana di Sorrento and now we're walking to the station. We're going to catch a train. We're going to catch a train to Castellamare. This is the station of Piano di Sorrento. You can also go to Sorrento or Meta di Sorrento if the bus happens to stop there. Get your tickets here. We've got off the train at Castellamare di Scabbia. So basically you get off the train, you come out the station into the ticket office, you buy a ticket for the cable car and then you go back into the station along the platform down to the end here where you'll find the other little station for the cable car. Funovia is cable car in Italian. So I'm just about to jump on this cable car. Did you know there was one of these here? It goes from Castellamare all the way up the mountain <laughs> to Montefajito, which is the highest mountain in the mountain range here. And then we're gonna walk back down to Positano. Just come over a ridge. My ears have just popped. And we've arrived. And you wouldn't know it, but we're up on top of the mountain. <laughs> we're in the wild, wild west. Now we have to find a way back down to Positano. <laughs> C'è Positano sulla mappa. Where the road splits, we're going left. Apparently we needed to go over the other side of the station, but it was closed, so he reckons we need to get over this hump. I will hear by Chris in this video how not to give directions. So we're now <laughs> traversing the hump. C'è una scala all'uscita della, sì. della funicolare che noi dovevamo salire per quella scala, sì. ma era chiusa perché sono gente di lavoro. E si arriva qua? E si arriva qua. Ok. Adesso che stero 35 a 35 minuti. There's a lot of empty houses up here. Montefaito back in the 80s was a bustling resort. It was like a mountain resort. There was um, big stables up here. So it was horse riding and hiking and lots of places to eat. And over the years it's declined so much. It's sort of in a state of ruin really. This is the Punto Panoramico. <laughs> Unfortunately, we picked the wrong day. Being the highest mountain in, air, in the area, there's a lot of um, these things, what they're called receptors, satellite. Oh, I can't think of the word. <laughs> We've come to another viewpoint here. Just imagine. <laughs> Signal towers, that's the word I was looking for. Lots of signal towers up here because obviously it gets perfect reception being so high up. So we are following the signpost to Santuario San Michele, which is a little church with an amazing viewpoint when it's not cloudy. So we have arrived at the Santuario di San Michele, the sanctuary of San Michele. Now this is a very famous lookout point, which I think is gonna be rather disappointing today. Here you can see the Bay of Naples. You can see Castellamare here below. The bay sweeping round towards Vomero <laughs> and the port of Naples. Absolutely beautiful. The church is up there. We've just walked down the road and we're cutting down this little pathway here. Remember, always follow the red and white stripes. It's very Blair Witchy and foggy around here. We're just about to arrive at the Molare, the Mola which is the very high point of the mountain. It's the bit you can see actually does look like a molar tooth. You can see it from Positano and 
on the way from Naples and uh, usually there's a fantastic view hey. all the way down to Positano but yeah probably not today si vede. that's the molare that looks si vede like a tooth sticking up and this is what's behind Positano Si? This is a carnivorous plant. Si come lo moscerini, vedi? Si, moscerini ci vanno sopra e rimangono attaccato sopra. It's a little baby fly. Qua è in pochi pochi posti. It's a really tough climb. It's really steep, but we're now at the very top in amongst the clouds. I'm gonna stop and get some food in a minute. Get some food, have sandwiches. From the very tippy tippy top of the mountain, we have a fabulous view of the Blue Sea and Positano right down there below you. Isn't it beautiful? No cloud. Dodgy building. Cloud. Really not a good idea, but boys will be boys. I have pretty much given up trying to give directions for this hike because with the fog, um, it's pretty hard to explain. So I'll leave the what details I can in the description box below. We're now walking over the ridge at the very top. We're starving hungry, so we're going to find somewhere to eat. We can safely say we are at the top. And we're going to stop and get some food and admire the amazing, wonderful view. Mm. Nothing ever tasted so good. This is the best excursion. Where are back down slowly the steps are really steep really uneven it's a pretty hard hike this one and we've just looked up and seen this rock behind us we're also concentrated on looking down at our feet and we're scared of falling but we didn't notice it also I just wanted to address the amount of humidity in the air our hair in front is absolutely soaking wet and also look at this pathway that we are about to walk on it's sort of terrifying because it leads into absolutely nowhere Ma dobbiamo fare questo? Ma perché non sono mai rispondi? No, perché non lo so. E Fabrizio dov'è? Here is a amazing view of Positano, right down below us. It is pretty tough going on all these rubbly stones. You can just see a tiny bit of Positano peeping through the clouds. Remember those forest fires last summer? This whole mountain has absolutely been destroyed by them. Everything is burnt. And we're finally down in Santa Maria Castello and we can finally see Positano below. What a terrible day for a hike. Ah, si, sì, la vedo. Giant asparagus, look. Wow. See, vai. Really big, juicy one, too. So Fabrizio goes foraging a lot and he knows where all the asparagus are. Mm. <laughs> there we go. That'll be dinner tonight for him. <laughs> so I just got home. This happened. We're now going to go in, going to get dry bath probably, cup of tea, and that is it. I'm not doing anything else all day. Bye.